Hey, what's up, boys and girls? I am Anakin Raider, and today I will tell you how to land a plane successfully in Flight Simulator 2020. This is the most difficult part of flying a plane. I will teach you today, step by step, how to do it, and the most common mistakes when we try to land and how to correct them. I am not an expert, but I am sure this video will help you a lot. Okay, let's start. First of all, I will ask you to watch the whole video. Don't skip any part of it, or you won't get to the to the airport safely. Before giving you some points of reference, like altitude and this and distance to the airport to start going down, I will tell you the main problem you are making. You don't know exactly when to start going down, and how to go down, and how to slow down. First, I will teach you how to go down. The main mistake you are making to go down is to lower the nose of the plane. Never do that. Don't do that because it will in increase the speed of the plane too much and you will end up crashing. So that is not the correct way. To slow down and make the plane go down, you have two ways. And please combine them. One way to slow down is to raise the nose of the plane a little. And number two is to slow down the engine, okay? Later, when I start landing, you will see how. Okay, when is it time to start going down? The first point of reference is when you are 16 miles away from the airport. So, keep an eye on that. You, when you are 16 miles away from the airport, your altitude should be between 13 or 14,000 feet. If you are higher or lower than that, please get to that altitude altitude as soon as possible. The second point of reference is when you are 10 miles away from the airport. Your altitude should be between 12 and 13,000 feet. Next. When you are 7 miles away from the airport, your altitude should be 10,000 feet. Now, when you are 4 miles away from the airport, your altitude should be 7,000 feet. From here, from here, your goal will be to get where the route marked in red starts okay it's like a a tunnel in red sometimes it gets blue i will explain this later don't worry you have to get to those squares they will guide, guide you to the, uh, to the to the airport track sorry okay guys now what we have to do is to look for the tunnel okay we have to enter the tunnel and this tunnel will take us safely to the uh, to the track <coughs> okay i have the game in spanish and it says muy rápido which means in english too fast it means i'm going too fast so what i told you the way to slow down is to raise the nose of the plane another way is to slow down the engine okay okay now when it turns blue is because you are doing it okay it was one of my first landing so i decided to show you this one because i made many mistakes that uh, uh, it will be better for you to see my mistakes maybe you are making the the same mistakes and how to correct them okay okay guys uh here for the goal is not to leave the tunnel okay not to leave the tunnel right now i think i'm going uh two down okay i'm going two down so i need to raise the nose to go a little up okay but if it is blue, if it is because it is okay, okay, you are doing it okay. Right now it says stop because I am going too slow. So I had to uh, speed up the engine, okay? To get to gain height. As you can see right now I I am higher, right? So because I had to speed up uh, the engine. And now it says two uh, too fast, muy rápido, okay? So, what I do right now is to slow down the engine, as you can see, and at the same time, uh, I have to uh, raise the nose. I mean, at, at, 
in every moment, every second, I have to uh, keep the nose uh, up, okay? I have to raise a little the nose of the plane, okay? So, uh, as you go through the tunnel, you see many mistakes. He says again, muy rápido, too fast. But I, ha I have to do to raise the nose again of the of the plane to slow down. It is one way to slow down. The other way is to, as I told you before, is to slow down the engine. Okay. I'm doing it. I'm doing it uh, well right now. But you listen to the word stop because uh, it indicates that I'm going too slow right I'm going too slow and I may crash okay you say listen to stop stop I mean uh, the remember that you can't overpass 110 uh, air speed okay never it, it should be your average uh, speed, okay, to go right. And where you, but when you are uh, landing, you should go uh, around 90. I think 90 is a good uh, air speed uh, to land, okay? Okay, it says the assistance of landing is activated right now when you take this turn. It's activated. So now it uh, automatically. Uh, activate the flaps but if you uh, but okay uh, the main purpose of the flaps uh, are to uh, slow down the airplane at this uh, at this point only activate the flaps when you are landing okay so as you can see it was one of my uh, first landings and I made many mistakes okay right now what I have to do is to center the plane with the track right center the plane the plane the plane and uh, I I I was realizing that I was going uh, too slow so I had to speed up the engine again and now I slow down the engine slow down the engine now I'm going to touch down to land now I didn't I couldn't do it in the first uh, try but in the second I quit what is the secret here there is a little secret. As, you, as soon as you think you are going to land, raise the nose a little. So, let's recap. Number one, as soon as you think you are going to touch down, as, as soon as you think you are about to touch down, raise the nose a little. Number two, press the brakes. Press the brakes. Two secrets. Raise the nose a little, and as soon as you, as do, as you touch down, as soon as you land, press the brakes okay what was my mistake here because i, th I thought i had already touched down and i raised the nose earlier that's why my airplane went up again that was my mistake okay so remember raise the nose a little and press the brakes okay guys that's all for today if you have any questions just let me know thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to okay that's all for today. Bye-bye.